Hey everyone, Leaf here. In this tutorial I'd like to show you how to scan and save QR looks in the latest version of Snapseed. There's a link in the description to some QR looks that I've made that you can download if you need something to use. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is to open Snapseed. If you don't have Snapseed you can download it for free in the App Store. Once you've got it open you'll want to open a photo. And once your photo is open, you're just going to want to um, import a look, which you can do by tapping the edit icon up in the top right um, corner of the uh, screen. So once you've opened the edit dialog, you'll see something that says QR look, tap QR look. And at this point, you'll want to have the QR looks that you've downloaded open so that you can scan them from the computer onto your phone. If you open them on your phone, you won't be able to scan them. So hit scan QR look, and that's applied the edits. So now that you've got these edits applied, you can see them um, in the edit icon by clicking view edits. And to save these, you'll open your looks icon here and you will scroll to the very end where there's a plus sign and you'll click the plus and this will open a save dialogue where you can name the look anything you want. So just, we'll name it new look. And now that that's saved, you can see it's added it down here at the bottom to your looks. So if you want to apply that to another photo, you just open another photo up. and you can apply the same look to any of your photos. And you can hold your thumb down on the image to see the before and after. So there you go, that's pretty easy. Hopefully it was useful and um, will improve your editing workflow. If you, if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel to see uh, more of my work. I make um, films as well as Instagram tutorials. And um, I'd really love to know if you found this tutorial useful and if there's anything specific you'd like me to cover in future videos. If you're on Instagram, you can check me out there as well and um, feel free to follow along on my journey on there. I'm su super active on Instagram and it's probably the best place for you to get in touch with me. So as always, thanks a million for watching guys and I'll um, see you all next time.